Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we're going to first look at Arsenal dealing hammer blow as Emiliano Buendia closes in on Aston Villa transfer move and then we're going to look at Grealish is coming as Arsenal fans have transfer theory of the latest Emiliano Buendia transfer twist. So the first transfer headline states that Arsenal dealt hammer blow as Emiliano Buendia closes in on Aston Villa transfer move. So the reports are stating that Aston Villa are reportedly set to be Arsenal to the signing of Emiliano Buendia after having a bid accepted for the Norwich midfielder. Emiliano Buendia notched up 15 goals and 16 assists to help Norwich secure promotion back into the Premier League at the first time of asking and the 24-year-old was named Championship Player of Season for his outstanding performances across the campaign. The Gunners initially registered a strong interest in Emiliano Buendia last January, but went on to complete a loan deal for Real Madrid's Martin Odegaard before reviving their move for the Argentine this summer, making two separate bids for his signature. However, according to various sources, Arsenal head coach Mikel Arteta looks set to be disappointed in the club's pursuit of Emiliano Buendia, with Premier League rivals Villa on the cusp of winning the race for the gifted playmaker. The report claims Villa had an offer accepted by Norwich for Buendia and a full agreement is said to be finalised over the next 72 hours. The transfer fee is likely to be between £30 million and £40 million, which will break Aston Villa's current club record deal set by Ollie Watkins, who joined for £28 million plus add-ons from Brentford last summer. Atletico Madrid and Valencia are also said to have explored possible bids for Buendia, but it appears certain the former Getafe star will be playing his football under Dean Smith next term. It remains to be seen whether Emiliano Buendia will arrive at Villa Park as a replacement for Jack Grealish or to play alongside the England star who continues to be heavily linked with Manchester United and Manchester City. You always dream of being at the highest level and the best teams in England, Spain and Europe, Emiliano Buendia told AS Argentina when asked about his ambitions for the future. You dream of challenging for titles. It is an ambition that I have. It's a source of pride that important clubs are interested in you as it means that you are doing things well and it provides motivation to continue working and one day achieve it. Discussing the interest surrounding Emiliano Buendia last month, Canary's head coach Daniel Farker suggested it would require an unbelievable offer to prize the midfielder away from Carroll Road. Of course, if one of the best clubs in the world wants Emmy as a starter and makes an unbelievable offer, then it could be a realistic solution for all parties, Daniel Farker told reporters. But Emiliano is a key player and it always is my task and our task to make sure that we keep the key players. It is due to the great work of sporting director Stuart Webber, we have them under long-term contracts. That means if a club wants them, they have to invest an unbelievable amount of money. If there is a club who wants to put crazy offers out there, maybe you use this to help the club in the future. But as a head coach, my first thought is to work further on with our key players. So it looks like Emiliano Buendia will be an Aston Villa player. And this nicely takes us on to the second piece of transfer news, which states that Jack Grealish is coming as Arsenal fans have transfer theory of the latest Emiliano Buendia twist. So the reports are stating that Arsenal supporters have come up with a transfer theory about Aston Villa attacking midfielder star Jack Grealish after a fresh update emerged about the future of Emiliano Buendia. This summer's transfer window may not have officially opened for business just yet, but already Arsenal and their supporters are confident that better times are around the corner. After finishing 8th in the Premier League this season and failing to qualify for a place in Europe for the first time in 25 years, a big summer rebuilding project is poised to take place at the Emirates Stadium as Gunners manager Mikel Arteta looks to turn his side into a more competitive force once again. It is understood that the North London outfit, who finished the campaign with five successive wins to their name, are keen to add five new faces to the first team squad this summer, but that all rests on outgoings, with the likes of Lucas Torreira and Ainsley Maitland-Niles amongst those that the club are willing to let go. Even though the window does not officially open until Wednesday, the Gunners have been linked with a whole host of names including Norwich City ace Emiliano Buendia. 
It was first reported that the Gunners' interest in Buendia back in December, but they took until earlier this week before they lodged their first official bid thought to be around £30 million. The opening offer had been rejected, with Aston Villa in the driving seat to Dan the Argentine architect, making an offer closer to Norwich's valuation of £40 million. It is understood as mentioned right now that Villa are ahead in this race to secure his signature this summer but it is pretty much done between Buendia and Aston Villa and Arsenal have a huge role when it comes to getting Emiliano Buendia's services. However, the news that Villa are now ahead of Arsenal in the race and they have Buendia's signature, it has sparked a wave of familiar comments from some Ghana supporters on social media and with response to the latest update, some Arsenal fans seem convinced that if Villa have Buendia, Arsenal will launch an offer to sign Jack Grealish, who will be hoping to star for England at Euro 2020 this summer. In terms of what you guys have said, there are a lot of things that you guys have said regarding Jack Grealish making the switch to the Emirates Stadium. One person, one of you guys have stated Buendia to Villa, Jack Grealish to Arsenal. And another person of you guys have stated, imagine Buendia goes to Villa and we end up signing Jack Grealish. Buendia to Villa, Grealish to Arsenal, simple and with a laughing emoji. And many of you guys just keep on getting the same message on where the final of one of you guys have stated, Buendia in, Jack Grealish out gets on it at Arsenal. Although Jack Grealish has been constantly linked with the move to the Emirates Stadium in the last 12 months, as McLeod said the searches for a new attacking midfielder, it is almost certain that the above comments that you guys have made is a tongue-in-cheek manner. That is because Arsenal almost certainly would not be able to afford a sweep for Jack Grealish this summer, especially when taking into account that they are going to have to sell players before making moves for other targets who do not have valuations anywhere near as high as Jack Grealish's. With that said, it is clear that some Goddess supporters are in a jokingly frame of mind as they know deep down Jack Grealish will not be making the switch to the Emirates Stadium this summer. So you have to wait and see how this transfer pans out, but other than that guys, remain blessed. Stay tuned for the next video and peace.